Woo! Guys, let me just do this review on Hop Sand. Guys, Pound Syndrome is his latest album. Guys, I've been meaning to do the fucking review. I didn't get a chance to do the review because it's been so busy. You know, uh, me preparing for the showcase coming up this Friday. Everything, you know, I didn't get a chance to do. Been rehearsing, been... Guys, I did not get a fucking chance to do this review. But I'm getting ready to do this. Sand is just one of those rappers that go in. Okay. I really like his energy. Okay. He's he's very ruthless. He has a lot of raw emotion. Y'all, he just spits fire. Okay. He's depressed all the time on his songs. Okay. You, uh, uh, but he's very outspoken. And that's one of the things I like about Hop Sand. Guys, the pound, the intro, oh my god, I was catching my life when I was listening to it. I had a nice little boom, boom, boom beat or something like that. I was catching my damn life to it. The boy was going in. Forever 3, which is number 2, I liked it the beat. I liked it the message on that. I really think that he just went in and went off on this song. Okay, it's amazing. No Hope, which is one of my favorites. Okay, uh, 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 he, like... He is just a psychopath when it comes to the rapping, y'all. He just went straight in with no hope. Okay, guys, you guys got to you guys got to check it out. It's a very very good song. Uh, he's just spitting some some real shit on you know uh, for the real rappers. He is saving the rap game. You know, I, I wish that rappers like Tech Nine and Hopsin and Chris Calico. And Stevie Stone and, uh, and all these, I just wish all these people will recognize more. You know, everybody, and, and, and most of the most of the, the lyrics on this album, you know, I can sort of, I, I can so relate to. I wish that they stop playing this, this the, 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 the music that they playing on the radio now. Like he even said on one of his skits that. Uh, uh, all, all, all you hear now is people, uh, you don't understand what people saying on their songs, but they always have a nice beat. I, when I heard that, when he made that skit, I said, I totally agree with that. You know, um, he, he is just, he is really in for the kill with these rappers. Like, whoever, whoever done teeth this man off, whoever ticked this man off, it, 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 it's not, it's, it, it's not cool. It's not cool. He, he, he is in for the kill. That's one of the things. Ramona. Okay, he is just talking nasty, nasty, nasty shit on this song. Okay, I was listening to the song. I'm like, okay, like, like, like he, he, like he just brings a lot of emotion into his stuff, y'all. Y'all really gotta listen to it. Like this song with Ramona, which is number four, he just brought a lot of emotion out to it. Mr. Jones, okay. Uh, I was I was feeling that song. I won't necessarily say it was my favorite, but I was definitely feeling it. I think that he uh, uh you know set a good message. You know uh, uh, uh he just with a lot of just with, with every song on his album, which I get this album a ten out of ten. Okay, uh, I was uh, let's talk about another song. I was feeling uh, Fort Collins was a pretty okay song. Uh, I won't necessarily say it was my favorite, but it was okay. Uh, Crown Me, which is number eight. Amazing. Amazing. Like, oh my God. Did, he just went straight in with that song, y'all. Oh, that beat is just cold. Okay, I, I don't know if he's talking about Crown, like drink and pass me some Crown or something like that. You know what? I, I can't use a drink of that. Okay. But anyway, no. Nah. But I really like the, I really like the beat of that song. He really went in with that. Ill Mind of Hop Sand 7. Boy... Let me get my life right quick. Woo! Number nine. Mm, baby, baby. That song is cold as shit. Oh! Hell no. Just, oh, just, oh, hell no. That motherfucker went off on that. Mm, 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 mm. That is by far one of the best songs on this album, apart from Ramona, apart from um, Crown Me, 
amazing, y'all. I, I, I'm just feeling this album, uh, 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 FV Till I Die, featuring Swiss. Okay, I was definitely feeling that one. He was going in with that one. He had, a, you know, uh, he had a, a, a great amount of, like, a good three people that he fe had songs featured on. My Love, I guess, was, uh, is number 11. I guess he was uh, dedicating that to a, uh, his love, his girlfriend, or something like that. His long girlfriend or something. Uh, something like that. He's dedicating it to somebody. You know, No Fucks Given, number 12. Fire Track, a nice fire track. Uh, uh, fly was 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 uh, number thirteen was very emotional. Okay, uh, I I I felt him through every last one of these songs. I've been listening to this album. I, I I've been feeling. I felt I'm feeling him. I'm feeling his 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 flows. Like this dude is just cold. Okay, uh, I I didn't get a chance to. I haven't really had a chance to do any hop sand reviews because I don't usually know. When he comes out with stuff, you know, uh, but I'm glad I caught this one, you know, even though I'm like, maybe like four, three days late, then that, that's not that bad, but, uh, then we got number 14, I just can't, I just can't deal with the, like, this dude was just go. he just, I just can't, y'all, I, I gotta know the words, uh, some of his songs are so hard to come by, and it's so hard to learn some of his words to the songs, I gotta learn the words to these songs, but I, I'm really sorry I didn't get a chance to, to, to play any of the songs throughout the um, review. But, but, but please believe me, when you listen to this album, uh, you are going to catch your down life. All the Hop Sand fans, all the people a part of Hop Sand and his career, like they doing a, they're doing an amazing job. Like. His stuff needs to be well recognized. You know, he has a lot of great tempos. You know, um, he has a lot of good hooks. Uh, he uh, he talks about the auto tune. Uh, he just does a lot. Uh, like he has some powerful moments. Like, and, and I think his his best two powerful moments of this album was "Ill Mind" of Hop Sand Seven and Ramona and um, "No Hope" and definitely "Crown Me." Like these songs just. Are the best songs on the album. Even though I, I give this whole album a ten out of ten, just because of his good music choices, good rap, good 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 rhymes, good uh, good 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 come throughs, and he is so boy, does he throw shade? Mm. I I ain't saying no names, but he throwing shade on a couple of people in the music industry. I ain't gonna say no names, but. When you listen to the songs, you 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 y'all you, you, really gonna catch y'all like this is forever Brandon TV. I hope y'all enjoy this review. I'm gonna send a link in the description. Y'all better comment and tell me what y'all think about the album. This is forever Brandon TV.